This is so simple, it is absolutely genius. Stick around and we'll get right to it. You know, every now and again, you run across an item and you wonder why in the world someone hasn't thought of this before. And that's exactly the way I felt when I saw this little emergency power pole connector. Now, real quick, the power pole is rated at 30 amps. The Wago connector on the other side is rated at 20 amps. And I can see this being useful for a few different situations. My primary use case for this would be an emergency field repair uh, that I could make without having to have power pole crimpers with me. It might also be handy if you were going to a ham fest and you wanted to test out a piece of gear that didn't have power poles on it. This might give you a quick way to put those power poles on it. But it's really, really simple in the way it works. Let's suppose you've got a power pole that breaks while we're out in the field. Well, you can simply cut that power pole off, strip those wires back on the opposite end, and then lift up these little connectors right here, slide the wire in, close it back off, and you're back on the air. It will accept wire sizes from 12 to 18 gauge, and these things cost 12 bucks if you just buy one of them, or you can get two of them for 20 bucks, at least as of the time of this recording. If this is something you guys are interested in, these are called uh, AP Quick Cons. And if this is something you're interested in, you need to look up a guy on QRZ. His call sign is Kilo Echo 5 Echo Zulu Zulu. Head over to his uh, QRZ page and it'll have all the details where you can reach out to him through email and order a couple of sets of these. I am definitely glad that I ran across these and will keep one of these, or maybe two of them, in my field repair kit. If you found today's information helpful, be sure to give us a thumbs up before you head off. We will see you guys on the next one. Until then, 7-3.